Hi teachers, this is your sneak peek for my Google Classroom sentence or fragment. So on all of my Google Classrooms, I have a direction slide that comes first and there is a video showing your students exactly what they need to do. This video is of me manipulating my screen for all of the Google Classrooms. So this one is specific to sentence or fragment. So they're just going to play that and watch what they need to do. Then on the next slide, they have just sort of like an anchor chart that they get to go over what a sentence is and what a fragment is if they just need a little refresher before they start. Then what they're going to do on the rest of the slides, there are 20 practice slides. They're going to read this sentence over here and decide if it is a true sentence or if it's a fragment. So then they're going to pull this check mark to either sentence or fragment. And then if it's a sentence, they're done. They don't need to do anything else. But if it's a fragment like this one, they're going to pull it over to fragment and then they're going to use that fragment and make it into a sentence. So they could type, Sarah will plant the flowers in the garden. But for this one, they do need to use the whole fragment and figure out how to turn it into a sentence. So like I said before, this does have 20 practice slides. If you want to break that down, you can just delete what you don't want. I've had people break it up into two different lessons. So just make a copy and delete the ones that you don't want. And then there is also, here, let me go a little slower so you can see these. So these are just randomly sentence or fragments. There's no pattern or anything. All right, and then at the end, there's an answer key. So please make sure that you get rid of this slide before you assign it to your students. Otherwise, they're gonna know what all the answers are. But I included an answer key because I know when you start to grade all of these Google Classrooms, they tend to get a little, into a little bit of a blur. So I like to put this on a Chromebook next to me on a separate Chromebook than the one I'm working on. And then I can just have the answer key right there and make sure that everything's correct. Or you can even print this out on a piece of paper and have it next to you as you're grading. But that is the teacher sneak peek for sentence or fragment.